What is going on everyone? Shio Sai on 5 here and I'm bringing you a brand new episode of the Saints Row 2 Let's Play. Now in the last episode we ended up going and defeating the Brotherhood. We finally went and killed Marrow. Ended up uh, having a big battle with him. Wasn't too big on the final one though, but yeah, now we've got the old tour, which is going to be, I believe, the last uh, actual storyline mission for the main story arc. And then we'll be moving on, of course, to the DLC later on. But for now, let's just go and start up this old tour mission and see what happens. As many of you know, the restoration of Saints Row is a tremendous success, but that was just the beginning of what Old Tor has in mind for Stillwater. This is Shivington. Once a pristine set of tenement homes, this neighborhood has devolved into a dangerous ghetto filled with undesirables such as these. Now, I'm sure a lot of you are wondering, ugly buildings, unwashed masses, what the hell is Old Tor thinking? My friends, we are thinking about the future. Picture this, glass towers, clean streets, and no one below the poverty line trying to wash your car. Impossible? For a lesser company, maybe. Now, I'm not here to make idle promises or vague predictions. No offense to all of you politicians out there. <laughs> no, I'm here to show you how we're going to do it. Now, obviously, before we can remodel Shivington, we need to own the land. So how do we do that? by directing the gangs towards Sunnyvale. Not only are we lowering the number of our detractors, we are lowering the property value as well, which means when we buy the land, the savings get passed on to you, the stockholders. The gangs cripple each other. We direct funds to the Stillwater Police Department, they increase police presence, and pretty soon, all those nasty little gangbangers are gone. Crime stops, property value goes up, and now your population looks like this. Well, so that seems to be that. But it looks like there's just another mission that we're going to have to go and do. Um, I guess that was just a little precursor to what exactly the story is. And yeah, let's just go and start up the other part of this. So it's pretty much about the same thing that happened with um, you know the first game where they ended up removing the main like all the uh, um, gangs and they ended up having one main gang and that one main gang got taken down pretty quickly kind of thing. So you know it's it's pretty much just like uh, you know your regular kind of marketing scheme and whatnot. So let's just go and drive over to the next old tour uh, mission thing and hopefully this one isn't that short of a uh, of a uh, mission. But, uh, let's see here. So we're at the cinema now, and let's go and see what Ultor has in store for us. better. Alright, so here comes old Tor trying to uh, barge in on my, uh, you know, fine relaxation time. So let's go and destroy them, get them out of our way, and continue on to our next destination. Yeah, there's a few more be in a bit of a trouble. Uh, let's see here. Ooh, hey there. I have no idea what the hell happened there, but for some reason my uh, my analog stick decided to go all the way up rather than you know, actually go where it needed to be. So let's see here. And there's him. And there's you. And let's see here. Ooh, that guy's ragged on. Alright, and whoop, one more. Alrighty, 
so there's that. And we'll go and exit out of here. Oh shit. Oh, hello. I can't talk right now, Gad. I'm killing some people. Yeah? Well, I got a couple APCs trying to rub my ass down. Listen, if they're coming for us, you can bet your ass they're gonna go pierce the Shawnee too. You've gotta go check on them. Thanks for the heads up. I'll check to see if they're okay. Alright, so now we're gonna have to go rescue Pierce and Shandi. So it seems that Ultor's really just trying to eliminate the Saints in general. I mean, it's not, you know, like blowing up a boat or anything, but it's something. So let's just go and continue on over here. Uh, let's see here. So then, I guess we're just gonna go to the nearest one, whichever that one points me off into the direction of. And let's see here. I'm just, you know. I'm just glad I ended up taking one of these uh, APCs rather than, you know, taking one of the Ultra vehicles. Because I probably would not be able to take all this damage that they're, you know, filling out for me. And let's see here. There we are. It's kind of funny that, you know, they're trying to go and do all these things, but I'm still on this APC, which they really aren't going to do much. There we are. Alright, so let's continue on. Alright, come on. There we are. Just gotta get the uh, speed up going. And they just keep trying to make these blockades, and I'm just not seeing them because I kept looking at my rear view. But let's just keep going on and see who we end up rescuing first. Um, but let's see here. Squash them. And now we're just gonna have to go through here. Oop. There we are. Move it, move it, move it. There we are. There we are. Okay. And all right. So we'll get out of here. All right. So let's go and get over here. There we are. There we are. All righty. And okay, and we got this guy over here, and and we got them. There we are. All right, so Pierce is first to be rescued. <laughs> you got some amazing timing. All right. So now we have to go and rescue Shandi. Let's go and take another APC. And if Pierce wants to get in here. Come on, Pierce, there you go. I don't really have much time for you. We need to go and rescue Shandi before they go and get her, of course. Holy crap, there, I've already got the helicopter coming after me. Again, it's a good thing I chose the APC rather than you know, actually getting a, a chopper. Holy, what the hell, man? I can't even get out of here. There. Oh my god, come on, man. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm, like, not even able to get out of here. There we are. Alright, there we are. Fucking A, man, that was... That was a lot. I was not expecting to have that many, uh... Freaking problems going on. Can I get out of here? Oh, I cannot. Okay, stop doing this to me. Okay, let's go this way. We'll just move on through here, if we can, and we'll, okay, they can go and do that, I guess. Alright, so we'll just push it along this way. Um, where is, Sh okay, Sean's going to be on the other end of town, figures. Okay, so I do need to go and find a way to get to the, um, freaking, uh, to the freeway through here. So we'll just go down through here and move on. Now it's too bad Pierce can't like go on the freaking gun and start shooting them or something. Because it's it would be really handy to go and do that. But let's see here, move on through here. And we're gonna get taken out. Boom, alright. So come on, let's go. Frick, hey man, they are taking forever with this. I'm trying to just get out of here and they're like not even letting me. Alright, so come on. Are you kidding me? It's giving me so much freaking problems right now. 
Here, I'm gonna go and do this. Or, oh, oh, there goes that. And let's try this one more time. Alright, get in the car, get in the car, get in the car. Alright, where the hell is Pierce at? Pierce, get in the car. Come on, Pierce. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. There you go. Oh my god, man. Pierce is taking forever in there. And then these guys just don't fucking let me go. Okay, you have two roadblocks, like one after the other. What the hell, you know? And there's another roadblock. And. Oh, no! Fuck! You're kidding me. Oh, that is just horrible right there. Horrible freaking timing. Alright, let's see if I can't freaking rush this thing or something. I'm gonna try to make it as close to shore as I can so that way it doesn't give me too many problems, but I'm probably gonna end up being uh, taken out in the, in the water. This thing's gonna be weird on the audio too. It's already being weird for me. So, let's go and try this one more time. Come on, speed this up. Oh my god. You know, it really figures that they would do that. Yeah, as soon as, like, Pierce comes in, he gives me so many freaking problems. It's freaking ridiculous. But let's just go and get closer to that shore, so that way if it ends up spawning me, he'll spawn me on shore rather than, you know, all the way across town or something, like it likes to do. But let's see what happens. Okay, come on. And let's see here. Okay, nothing much. Oop, I think that's the chopper over there. Okay, let's see what happens now. Alright. So it did not spawn me all the way across town like I was thinking it might have. So, that's good. Uh, but let's see here. Let's just go and find a vehicle first. Uh, we might actually need some uh, backup, so let me go and get these people going. Alright. And... Uh, let's see here. I need a car. Alright. Okay, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, Pierce, get in the car. Pierce, get in the car, there you go. Alright, so now they're going after Shandy, and she's in a van, and I need to get over there quickly. Okay, don't know why it decided to go and do that. This car was weird. I barely tapped on it and decided to keep going on that direction. Alright, let's see. Come on. Oh, there's that, but I'm already in this van with a whole bunch of people, which I'm going to be needing. So let's go this way and oop, there they are. So okay, so they already picked up Shandy, and really all I need to do is just okay, so let me go and blow these guys up. Okay, so we are, move along, move along, move along. I don't care about my homie who's dead in the car. As long as it's not Pierce, I don't really care. Because Pierce is going to be the one that's going to be ending it for me if I don't end up getting it. So, let's go this way, and... Alright, so... caught on fire and if this thing would like to turn there we are freaking turning on this thing is horrid it's not even like letting me do anything it's freaking ridiculous all right so come on you stupid fucker there we are come on oh, there it goes Okay, so there's that. I liked Ultor a lot more when they just made clothes. What you do to piss these guys off? Fuck if I know. Yo, I signed on for killing gangbangers, not fighting some SWAT team from hell. Don't worry about it, Pierce. We'll take care of it. The fuck you mean don't worry about it? These guys are packing space-age shit. 
Hey, Shandi, you did anyone that worked at a place called the Pyramid? No. For real? All right. You two find out whatever you can about this place. I want to take these assholes apart. All right, so I guess this isn't exactly just a final mission like I thought it was. I kind of, again, I haven't really played through these story arcs in quite some time, so I don't quite remember all of what happened, but it just looks like this is going to be the uh, Ultor story arc, I guess. So let's see here. What are we at for time right now? Well, we didn't take too long on the uh, mission there, so I guess we can go and let's see here. Let's see. Okay, here we are. So let's see here. Do we got another mission? Of course we do. Uh, but I'm just going to go and actually end it here, you know, uh, better yet to just do a few of these missions rather than actually do a whole bunch of them at once to, you know, bombard it or whatever. Plus, yeah, it makes it a bit easier for me. But I'm just going to go and end it here. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And until the next one, guys, I'll see you guys later. All right, peace.